Wilmert, thank you very much for that report from CNN Jerusalem. The last time we heard from Charles Jaco, he was heading for a bomb shelter at, at Dahran, and we will be back to him as, as soon as we can. Uh, there were sirens in the background, but no signs of any incoming anything. The United States and the UN uh, Allied Forces have launched a massive air attack on Baghdad, Iraq tonight, wave after wave of planes coming over but apparently doing pinpoint bombing, going after strategic targets and not saturation bombing. Let's switch now to the focus of much of the diplomatic negotiation that preceded tonight's action and Jeannie Mose at the United Nations. David, the uh, members of the UN Security Council are expected to meet here at the UN for consultations on this sometime tonight. The Secretary General of the UN told us as much a short time ago uh, on his way out of the building. We're not sure when. Uh, the U.S. mission to the United Nations is saying that probably sometime after the President of the United States speaks. In any case, the Secretary General of the UN was watching all of this on television. Uh, he left the building a short time ago saying he would be back soon. And uh, here is some of what he said on his way out the door. After all my efforts, after, after all the efforts of uh, so many countries and so many personalities, that we are now facing a war. And then uh, at this very moment, only one hour and a half after the hostilities, I am not well informed. I have not a lot of, uh, of details about what has happened. But I think it's for me to express my deep sorrow because of uh, a Secretary General of the United Nations, a peace organization,